Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Rogues and Role Players. Hi. We're playing Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone on yeah. PS1. You, you, you have said that we would be <laughs> playing this before the year's end, so here it is. Yep. And so. all of the multiple Harry Potter owls, because apparently he has three now. <laughs> oh, we got to create a memory card on your PS3. <laughs> Oh yeah, <laughs> I actually I created a partition on my uh, PS3 so it could actually save PS1 games, hmm. but it doesn't yeah. allow me to save PS2 games, which is weird. But whatever, it's, it's, it's because your uh, PS3 isn't like the original OG. Like it supports PS2 games. Yeah, version. it's just weird that it would let me do PS1 and then. Yeah, whatever. every PS3 can play PS1 games, but not PS2. Yeah. It's weird. So this is the backstory for Harry Potter. Uh huh. So are you? Because I, I know you're not like super familiar with Harry Potter, but do you know like do you have any familiarity with it? Uh, kinda. The giant. Like with the like with the introduction of the story or anything. So no, Hagrid. Like was filling in for the stork. <laughs> Dropping off babies at people's uh, doorsteps. Hey, you're a baby, Harry. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds like something he'd do. So I remember them. That was his, the his evil muggle, yeah. mugglies, muggle uh, family. Yeah, yeah. His uh, a, a muggle uncle and aunt. God, the the artwork is giving me like Zelda CDI almost kind of like <laughs> yes, <laughs> a little bit better, but still we're we're aiming in that that territory. Yep. So he's on. Platform nine and three quarters. Yeah, they, they skip past all the good bits of the character building. They're just going straight to when he goes to the school. To Hogwarts, yeah. 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 I mean, this isn't a particularly good game. <laughs> but we, I, we, we've decided that we need to do some more bad games on the channel. And this is, this is one that I've been wanting to do. Because uh, when I was a kid, I used to be a huge uh, Potterhead. And um, I remember, uh, like... On the PS One, I used to play the heck out of this game for some reason. <laughs> did you did you hear what the Sorting Hat guy read? What what is it? It's just like the because like normally I, like in the movie he yells out like Gryffindor, but he's just kind of like whispering in his ear. And oh my god, is that who I think it is? <laughs> it's Dumbledore. I have to lean back to balance out my beard. <laughs> <laughs> there is voice acting, but for some reason, sometimes it like takes a minute to kick in. <laughs> really? Yes. No, Hogwarts. Oh, there it is. <laughs> so search behind. The audio design in this game is terrible. Mind. I love it. Not all secrets are rewarding. Oh, he looks like a sloth. Gosh. Yeah, he does. <laughs> the third floor corridor. The Santa Claus sloth. He's got the red coat, the big beard, taking over his body. Yep. Doesn't have to worry about the cold toilet seats, though. Oh, the controller. But what, the hell? what the hell? The controller's not working. What? It's not? It's not working. Here, let me see. <laughs> you have to use the D-pad. Really? Tweak I have to use the D-pad. <laughs> oh, early PS1. <laughs> All right. We're using the, the D-pad. Did the original PlayStation controllers even have a, a joystick on them? No, the, when the PS1 oh, first came out, no. Yeah, so this may that may be what it's programmed for. Place to Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> I love I just... going back and playing old games because it's just things <laughs> that you forget. I completely <laughs> forgot that this game is D-pad and not control stick. <laughs> And like, whenever I accidentally, like, bumped into him, he was just like, nitwit. And I was just like, that's not very nice, Dumbledore. My god, that's Fred and George. That's really? Yes. What? <laughs> they look like rejects from a Cat in the Hat game. <laughs> Fucking character models of this game are terrible. It's amazing. Like, strangely enough, Harry himself is the only one that, like, looks decent. Uh, this is what happens when you eat too many every flavor jelly beans. <laughs> so, we gotta collect, uh, every flavor beans to get passwords to see. You lose any definition in any of your features. <laughs> Gabba Traconis. Uh, gobbledygook. <laughs> That's right. I remember. Uh, close the... enough. <laughs> I'm bored. 
I'm the fat lady. I got nothing better to do than to sit in a portrait all eternity. So are, are those actual people in the pictures or is that like what? What? What is going on? Why are there frogs in your room? Because reasons. It's Harry Potter. Um, so these are the save points. And uh, this is one of those games. Of course, it's really PS1. We don't have an auto save. We got to save our game. <laughs> yeah, or else we're going to have to run back mm -hmm. and do stuff again. Can you can you even jump in this game? Uh, no, I believe it has an auto jump, kind of like Zelda. So huh. It's it's kind of that like you know you just run through the edge and you automatically jump kind of thing. That sounds dangerous. <laughs> Don't run to the edge, kids. <laughs> Living on the edge. So, so what what is our objective? Because I don't remember seeing anything telling us what we needed to do. It's just like, welcome to Hogwarts, nitwit. We're just doing <laughs> stuff. Let's talk about draconises and chocolate frogs. <laughs> I do love chocolate frogs though. Have you ever have you ever had like the official like chocolate frogs from Harry Potter? Can't say that I have. They actually are pretty good. It's pretty nice, high quality chocolate. Also, Ron's model also looks terrible. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm assuming everybody besides maybe the character you're controlling is just a nightmare. Yeah. There's Malfoy. I'm sure he's a nightmare. <laughs> yep, he's a nightmare. <laughs> you know, with the way his hair was in the movie, it looked like he kind of had like a helmet of hair, but this makes it just a literal helmet of hair. You don't have one, do you? Ah, jerk. I don't have one what? Don't have a mother. Oh. Well, I mean, I was born, so at one point I had to move. Us Gryffindor should stick together. Yeah. <laughs> it's just... This game is one of those games that I know is terrible, but for some reason I absolutely love it. push forwards on your controller. For some reason... What? what? <laughs> controller? What are you talking about? He's talking about the tutorial. Have you been eating too many every flavor jelly beans? Are you breaking the fourth wall, what, Weasley? Yeah, he... T yeah, for some reason, like, they just kind of <laughs> pick and choose when to break the fourth wall. <laughs> yes, we did it! He did it again! I have seen beyond the mortal realm. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, the jumping like mechanics are so wonky. Double back and watch the entrance. You better go on and rescue Hedwig. So we gotta Hedwig. rescue our owl Hedwig. Oh, is that the name of the owl? I didn't yeah. know it ever had a name. Yeah, his name is Hedwig. The oh. little white owl that Harry has. I always thought it was like he named it after like Hagrid. <laughs> the owl's name is Hagrid. I'd be fine with that. <laughs> I'm an owl, Harry. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> That'd be amazing. Nearly headless Nick. Oh, that's right. Yeah, because he's he's nearly headless because he technically has his head, but it's not attached. Like fully, it's like dangling on. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, God, that's gotta be annoying. La -di -da -di -da. <laughs> just walks face first into a wall. <laughs> so one redeeming factor I think this game has is I actually really like the music. The music is actually pretty pleasant. Yeah. It actually kind of reminds me of um oh my. of Elder Scrolls. Wait, wait, wait. Oblivion. Is that is that Jack Black? Wait, Jack Black. This picture right here. Oh, the one that's yeah, like the right one right in front of, in front of you. It kind of looked like Jack Black from the side. A little yeah, bit. A little, yeah, the face is a little <laughs> stretched, but it's an older Jack Black. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. I can totally see. <laughs> I didn't know he was a wizard. Jack Black is a... W <laughs> You're a wizard, Jack. <laughs> oh, my like, goodness. I, so I remember whenever this series of books like first came out, like mm -hmm. everyone lost their mind. Oh yeah, including me. I I was I was huge into Harry Potter when I was little. It was just even back then. I saw the like the thickness of the book, and I was just like, "Nah, I'm retiring from reading." <laughs> you know, I think it's funny that you are saying that about the first book when the first book is like nothing compared to how thick the later books are. Oh yeah, once once the author realized how much people would actually read, they decided to go whole hog on it. <laughs> Harry Potter was like the only series of books. That like really got me reading into like a like a geek like a geek book franchise. You know what I mean? Like a lot of people like the people had their Lord of the Rings. Others had their Song of Ice and Fire. I had Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. uh, Harry Potter was my book it's, series. What? Oh my God! You just incinerated that snail. Yes, I did. 
And I did what did, he, what did he call it? Flipendo knockback jinx? Yeah, Flipendo uh, knockback jinx. Is that actually from the book, or is that something they just made up for this game? I actually game? don't... I think it's something that they just made up, if I recall. Because Flip... I, I'd never recall seeing Harry Potter use an actual <laughs> All I've ever spell. heard him use is, what is it, Expecta Patrona or yeah, whatever? Yeah, expect, well, Expecta and, Patronus and, is like one of his, like, he, he learns the, that in the in the third book. It's the magical version of Inspector Gadget. <laughs> Expecto Gadget. And then just Inspector go, Gadget go, shows Patronus. Up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. But uh, it, the spell that Harry most commonly uses is Expelliarmus. Oh, that's right. Whenever you have to fart really bad. Yes. <laughs> a, rid a big electric red beam <laughs> comes out of your Expelliarmus! <laughs> I got you. <clears throat> so now there's puzzle solving involved, and it's not particularly uh, difficult puzzle Who's solving. giving us points for, for doing this stuff? I don't know. For some reason, we're getting... Uh, Gryffindor house points. So it's just, who's watching us this whole time? It's just like <laughs> nearly said this. Nearly had this. He head. pushed a block. <laughs> Ten points for Gryffindor. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I didn't realize it was that easy to. Oh, oh my God! What? What are some of these portraits? I don't remember seeing nearly this no. many in the. Get, get, get out of here, rat! Get out of here, rat! There we go. Gotta I got. Flip I got, them over like an. I omelet. got five points from Gryffindor for killing a rat. I mean, you didn't even kill it. It just you just made it smaller. Oh, it's a mysterious man in a hood. Kind of reminds me of Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's Organization Thirteen. They've invaded the world of Harry yeah, Potter. Yeah, they're the one giving away points. They're the they're the uh, the neutral judge of the house challenge. <laughs> they're the ones who decide who gets the house cup mm -hmm. at the end of the school year. <laughs> I will be all for that. God, it would be so convenient if I could walk through walls. Like that guy. So I can charge up my Flipendo spell. I can move, use it to move bigger stuff. Geppetto. And I got five points for doing that. <laughs> because why not? I just... Wait, wait, wait. Char, charge up the, the, the Flipendo thing mm -hmm. and just, like, run in a circle. It's just the way he's leaning back with it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like he's it's, about to go for a slam dunk with his wand. It kind of looks like he's at a concert. It's, just <laughs> it's like somebody's like singing like this really Woo! emotional song. No, 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 no. This, this is the this is the yeah the emotional song where you pull out the lighters. Exactly. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Free bird. <laughs> Why do I smell marijuana? <laughs> It's so true. <laughs> Have you ever been God. to BuzzFest? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've been to BuzzFest. Yeah, I, I have been to plenty of concerts where you, you smell, like, I would. <laughs> you can smell the I was, weed. I went to a concert. I, I think it was the 40 Licks tour. Mm -hmm. uh, and. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I, th I, could, I think I was like 12 or 13 or something, and I, I had no idea like what it was and I just like I smelled something and I was just like something smells weird and my dad just laughed and said nothing <laughs> it's kinda, it, it's, it wasn't until later that I realized oh that's what that smell was yeah, I had a similar experience when I went to BuzzFest all those years ago because I could smell it in the air I'm like what the heck is that smell my friend next to me just starts laughing and he never explained it oh my god it's Neville Longbottom <laughs> It looks like somebody's just squishing his face it like forward like you have like the the cheek pinchers but they're just they're instead of like pulling the cheeks they're squishing them into his face. Yes. Instead of like pinching his cheeks it's just kind of like his bleh. entire face is just like Vroom. Come on you stupid book. Well, that's annoying. There we go. He's got to wait till they're standing still. That's no fun. Especially whenever you have unlimited magical energy. The way he runs makes it look like... I am the librarian now. <laughs> the way he runs just makes it look like he shit his pants. And he's just trying to <laughs> fucking hide it. There's a stain on the inside of my robe. Don't look. <laughs> That's what his run animation looks like. There's, Aries isn't much better. There isn't a laundromat in this place. 
<laughs> Nobody here can clean my robes. Hey, we have to clean our robes with magic, but they haven't taught me the spell yet. <laughs> my God, that's oh my God, he looks like a bug owl. <laughs> <laughs> His face is completely flat. <laughs> All right, editor, I want a pug owl now. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Hegerdig. Oh my god. Might free Hegwood from those bars. Or Hedwig, sorry. Oh, Hegerberg. I don't know what I said. <laughs> it's okay. Go free, pug owl. <laughs> His face is just completely flat. <laughs> Wait, it's like he flew face first into a wall. <laughs> That's what he looks like after. And then it never, the it never sprung back out. <laughs> also, he could have easily just gone out the other direction and left. That is a perfectly good point. He flew out. <laughs> He wasn't trapped. <laughs> no, the exit's right here on the other side of the cage. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this game. I see you rescued Hedwig. She yeah, we rescued Hedwig. The, the, the pug she owl, right? Yep. Uh, that'll teach never... him from messing with Gryffindor. <laughs> Gryffindor. Go Gryffindor would totally be my house, though. Was he made of chocolate? I may have eaten him. <laughs> Was your toad made of chocolate? Because I have been eating some chocolate frogs. <laughs> it's quite delicious, your frog. I mean, those chocolate frogs. <laughs> they were great. The audio what? design is so terrible. Did he just? Did he just bring us a broom? Yep, our pug owl gave but us a broom. I thought it didn't. Didn't in the movie you get a broomstick from Professor oh, sure. uh, McGonagall? Yeah, that one. <laughs> so I was gonna say Muggle Duggle, but that did not sound right even in my head. <laughs> Muggle Duggle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. We'll see you guys next time for more Harry Potter because we're about to go uh, do a broomstick. Yay! Lesson. We're learning things about a universe that I have no idea about. <laughs> you'll learn. <laughs> no, you'll, I won't. You'll. you'll <laughs> Yeah, maybe not, but we'll see everybody next time on Rogues for more Harry Potter. <laughs> Submit your own favorite like spin-off versions of what you should name all four of the 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 the, the Harry Potter houses down below. Hogwarts houses. Because I have I have Gryffindorf and I haven't decided on the other three so far. <laughs> Gryffindorf. It sounds like surf and turf. Yes, it does. But a mystical, <laughs> mystical, mystical bird version of Gryffindor. shrimp and scampi. Shrimp and scampi. <laughs>